Kevin Kelly Hutchinson, Kenosha. First of all, for all those that watch the YouTube, I want to thank all the parents for your support, for your calls, and all your encouragement. To the parents and citizens of the Kenosha Unified School District, you know the saying, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. Well, guess what? In the near future, the school district is going to ask you to continue to participate in the insanity. They're going to come before you with a referendum asking for more money. Should you agree to this? Citizens in the know say with a resounding voice, absolutely not. Why should you throw money at a system that has the following features? A district that has huge percentages of students that can neither read nor perform mathematics at their grade level. A district that can neither hire nor retain teachers, and a district that can barely fill their gaps with substitutes. Recently, a group of Kenosha parents found out and complained about pornography in the schools. What happened? Were these materials removed? No. Your own superintendent, Dr. Weiss, just approved All Boys Aren't Blue for your 13-year-old children. This book has rape, incest, and sexually explicit material in it. I, def I definitely must be old because in my day, men protected kids. They didn't cave into the mob. Should you throw your money at a school district where girls don't use the bathrooms all day because men are allowed in their facilities? Should you throw money at a school district where teachers fly huge transgender flags and when kids complain, they're told to sit down and shut up? Should you throw money at a school district where librarians put books out in front of your young kids telling them that their gender's wrong? There's many reasons why the KUSD is losing kids and the census is falling. The board and administration want to tell you it's just low birth rate. This is a reason, but it's not the reason. The reason is that the district has gotten away from what schools are supposed to do and that's to educate children. Parents in the know are finding any alternative means to educate their kids. Maybe there'll come a day when the school district decides to right its ship. Maybe there'll come a day when the district looks out for the common good for everyone, not just a few. But this is not the day. Pay attention, Kenosha. They're coming for, four mo for more money, which they have not earned. Remember, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. Don't participate in this insanity. Thank you.